What is up, YouTube? It is your boy, John. Uh, play some more Farming Simulator 22. We're back on Westview, Wisconsin. Let's get to it. Hello? Hello? What's up? What, what happened with your team speak? I have... Did it say I banned you like it did for Trent last night? No, just nothing oh. showed up. Oh. All right. So there I was connected, but nothing. Channels. Oh wow! You know, nothing. But he's like disconnect, reconnect. I tried that like six times. I had even tried oh. closing it earlier and restarting it. So I didn't do anything. Same thing. Didn't do anything since last night. I didn't break it. it wasn't me. The player you can turn to me. Oh. I just went as far as starting to set up a uh, stream on the <laughs> channel in <getting laughs> the Discord. <laughs> Because everything I had tried earlier in the day, yeah. none of it worked. So it's just like, well, I uh, do this. Sean, I don't think, I, I think I need to watch a movie then. Because I it, I thought it was funny, though. I thought it was funny. Uh, James, what's going on, man? How you doing today? So, guys, the other day, uh, th we, Thursday, I spent like three and a half hours out here picking up grass, right? Which I have figured out a few things that would have helped with that. Uh, remember the other day I was trying to like have more than one truck go to my harvester at the time storms. Remember that? Mm -hmm. And I turned the setting on for that, which is great. You can totally do that, right? Okay. The problem is because I don't have a fill capacity because I'm not a combine. I don't have a, I mean, I have my little, like, my little additive, but like I don't have a, a grain tank like a combine, right? Right. So what I actually had to do was I actually had to take the, the fill level, the call call level, right? And put that to zero. And then that setting works great. Boom, two trucks show up. All right, so learn, learn that with a forge harvester. You gotta put that setting to zero and then put it to yes. I currently have it turned off because these are such short passes that uh, two trucks were causing problems out here. Uh, so there's that. Uh, how much mommy you got snow? Awesome. How much did y'all get? I'm not looking for. I mean, I am, but it, like, I want to get my Christmas lights up. Then it can snow all that at once. Just saying. Hocus Pocus, Sean. I don't know if I've ever seen Hocus Pocus. Should this be the year that I like actually watch some Chris or Christmas, some ha Halloween movies? <laughs> Maybe this is the year, huh? I'm always looking for something to like watch, you know. Just a dusting, but supposed to get more. Gotcha. Like I said, let me get my Christmas lights up, then bring it on. Uh, so any hoozles, um, I started this yesterday before stream, before rest last night. And as you can see, he has mode a fair bit. He has mode a fair bit. Uh, short rows are killing me right now because of, of the turning and like the truck likes to do 360s for no reason and, and stuff. But once we get back on the long rows, it should get better. Just saying. Quit swearing. What is, who, who's swearing? Oh, is it because we said snow, Jacob? Adam, it's going. What's up? was popping but see once he like pulls up well, it works great right it works great so what i'm actually thinking to kind of expedite this process and help us get this done is we kind of need to pick this up and then fast time for the wheat we you know we're, we're mowing the grass we might as well mow the grass right and get it done with right it's, i don't know my thoughts uh, let's see actually so for right now I've just been dumping it up here at the storage we put in the other day the 25 million worth of storage and so far we have 2.8 is that all that that is all isn't it yeah 2.8 that doesn't seem like enough does it storms well you're only single cut well okay that's true that's why it okay makes sense makes sense but my theory was if we could automate this process and like you know once a week or something just set it up at night and let her rip then 
Why not, right? I would almost say it might be a better idea mm -hmm. to just send mowers out. Okay. Send one uh, or even two tractors with uh, wind rowers on them. Mm -hmm. Copy the, that uh, course play. Put that into the pickups. Yeah, or the uh, you know four wagon with the pickup, and then set them up. That way, if we're like in the middle of a stream or something like that, grass cam comes up ready, and we need to mow or fast on some more. Mm -hmm. We can just go ahead, mow real quick. You know, get a couple more mowers and like four mowers out there at once. Yeah, but we can't do that during the stream. Is that magic leg that only affects me, you know? Yeah. <laughs> well, that sounds like a you problem. So. Uh, we did do the bean harvest and the howdy, y'all. What's poppin'? How y'all doing? What's poppin'? Oh, by the way, yeah, the silage. Um, what is that doing here? What is what doing here? Oh, I didn't realize left's in here. What's up with that header? Laughed? What are you doing? So, whenever I join the server, uh -huh. all these headers for me are linked together. Oh, yeah, those headers for some reason really, really, really don't like that shed or something. Yeah, and so, you know how, like, how plastic shrinks up whenever you put ice on it or something, you know what I'm talking about? Okay. So that's what the headers were all doing whenever I put one combine on them. All right. It's a little. I don't know if you s can see it. I don't know. I the other day I like drove past those. Um, I drove past that shed where the headers were, right? And like all of a sudden they just like all exploded like out of the shed. I don't think they like being close together at all. So I don't know if it's something where we have to storm like farther apart. So, I don't know. I don't know. It's kind of weird. Whatever is going on there. I'll fix it. I'm just... All right. Well, my plan for now, I'm going to start mowing, I guess, on this other side and, like, try to get this done. I don't know if you guys want to, like, take over a truck to try to expedite that process or, like, on the, uh... Oh, what's it called? With, like, the, the helper guy or if you want to take over the helper guy or, or whatever. He only had about an hour and a half left, so if we get two of us out here mowing, it shouldn't be that bad. Uh, if you're interested in joining the server, come in our team speak when we're not streaming and get to know us offline. That is how we add new uh, new farmers to the, to the to the server here. So yeah, uh, so that hit that button. That button, I it was unfolded enough. Come on now. Are you just sending all the headers back to, uh, or just resetting them left? Uh, I've got two of them reset. This is the third one. I don't know if we're written. Is it like that broken? <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's, it's... I tried to pick one up, and multiples came with me. How did we get to 18 millis where we're at five? We sold all of our silage. We sold, actually, we, we did sell all of our silage. We didn't really mean to, uh, but well, we. This... The 1.5 in the uh, well, in the thing, yeah. yeah. So, what you can't pick this header up, is that what you're saying? Oh, or wait, is this one fine? That one's fine, this that one's, one's fine. fine. So, go pick it up with a combine, and then you'll see what well, it's by itself. There's nothing else around it, yeah. I would assume it's fine then, right? Yeah, I would. All right, yeah. So, we what were we working on, Starms? What were, seed. Oh, yeah, we were, like, making seed and parking equipment and stuff. And then I look up and I'm like, oh, we don't have any silage. Uh, we have wheat in our fields, uh, doggy lover. Wheat. Uh, the money it will be used to landscape. I don't know how much of it I'll do today. I might do some. 
Uh, I probably don't want to do too much right now because we do have crop right there. And we might as well try to get the crop taken out before I go over there and, like, you know, cause a mess, you know? So, that would be maybe later after we get some of the crop out around uh, that area. So, yeah. How do you make seeds? We're using the AGI uh, seed maker from the AGI pack. Uh, AGI pack is free to download. Basically a DLC, but it's kind of a mod at the same time. It's from Giants. And, uh, oh, one of the things it comes with is the little seed treater guy. This, uh, this guy right here. Uh, you put this guy. There you go. Uh, you put an additive in here, a seed treatment, and then you put, like, we're using oats in this end, and boom, seed comes out the other end. And we may have upped our uh, storage capacities at the homestead as well, as far as seed uh, storage is concerned, and fertilizer, and Where's liquid the, fertilizer. Uh, second wagon at. Second wagon. What do you mean? So we had to those. Oh, uh, uh, we do. I on my tractor. I already pulled it out. Okay, I'll say I don't know where it is. To be honest. Okay, are you just taking the? Okay. Yeah, I'm just it's, I'm just gonna speed it up. Will you do me a kindness and cancel the course play course on that harvester? It is a beautiful course play course though, isn't it? I think it's already canceled, isn't it? That so you actually got to go in and like um, delete it. You know what I'm saying? Like delete it now. And I got to turn around now. Turn around. If anything, man, the end rows I got. Oh, yeah, you're good now. The end rows I got on this field are beautiful, aren't they? <laughs> it might be like 10 end rows, 9 end rows. I kept having problems with it turn like the... I probably should set it up on spiral and just do this whole field on a spiral. Because then the, the truck stays on the outside, which is perfect. Because you're always like trucks would stay on the left, let's say. And we're always turning to the right. And that's like... An ideal situation, like a hundred percent. Look, are you looking for the wagon mm -hmm. over here? I say Storm says it. I think. No. Oh. Oh. Oh, there. You go. Okay. Was this the one you were looking for, or when you said you're looking for a wagon? I thought you meant the auger wagon that for grain. No, 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 no. No, he's he's fix. trying to duplicate what I got going on, right? Yeah. All right now. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Holy goatee. Where's the beard? Uh, Probably in a landfill. What's poppin' goat? How are ya? I decided to shave it, you know, the start of winter. Makes perfect sense if you don't think about it. Can we get a repair station down here? Yeah, there is. It's uh, outside of one of the sheds. If you spiral the pot a potato, you can make her. Okay. All right. All right. Uh, Goaty, we are doing. We are doing. How are you? Oh, you said all good. Okay. <laughs> Is the goat? Oh, oh man. I can actually mow forever before I'm worried about trying to, like, empty. Which, this would be a lot faster than the course play way we were doing. But, like, the course play, you know, I tried to... It actually, it did do quite a bit uh, overnight. It, it was stuck when I came in here this morning, so... But it went from, like, six hours left to an hour and a half. So, I mean, it, it did work last night. Wow. All right, Goaty. Oh, oh, O'Reilly's. Nice and oh, I'm telling you. I don't know if that truck's ever actually going to catch up to me. I might have to, like, stop. I'd let him catch up, but I only have 40,000 on board, so I'm not worried about it yet, obviously. I'm just going to run till you know, 
I get full. Or until I have enough to fill him up, although I don't know how full he is, so. You have 15 hours left? Oh my goodness. That's a long time in our, uh, quiet. That's a long time. Are you cleaning up skippers left? Yeah, it was bothering me. <laughs> I can't help it. Oh, uh, the course play quarter skippers, right? Their thing. Actually, you know what? We're going to let him catch up to us this time. We'll go ahead and think I might be able to fill him up. Not too sure. Come on, Mr. Truck. Let's go. You got to love when these trucks just start doing 360s for no reason. I had one that was stuck last night for probably an hour just doing 360s out in the field for no reason. It was, it was pretty cool. Pretty fun. Should be able to fill him up, hopefully. Maybe. Oh, come on, just pull up just to. There we go. My trailer was not on the correct setting. Okay. Yeah, I'm actually not able to fill him up yet, but that's okay. He'll leave us alone eventually here, maybe. Go away, bro. Uh, Goaty Dad is currently uh, sick. He's got a cold. He sounded like... Uh, he sounded really bad last night. Let's put it that way. He went to work today. I mean, of course, he kind of has to go to work because there's nobody else to work, which infuriates me to no end. But, you know, you know, we've learned... We've learned... And I say we as, like, everybody. We've learned nothing... From like, you know, the past couple of years that like, hey, if you don't feel good, that's what your sick days are for. You know, you take a day off work if you're, you know, you don't feel good. But uh, somebody was uh, not feeling well at all the other day where dad works. And uh, spoiler, now dad doesn't feel good. So, you know, it's amazing how that works, right? And I've been around dad, so I'm sure that uh, my time is soon. For, uh, for getting it too. So if you don't, if you guys don't see me, you know, Monday or something, we'll see. But uh, yeah, he sounded he sounded bad last night. Did not sound good at all. And then of course once I heard how he's outed, I'm like, well, I'm just not going in the house anymore. <laughs> I'll try to avoid the situation as much as much as possible. Doordash to the garage. <laughs> right, bringing around back. <laughs> I got a bucket out here instead of going in the house for the bathroom, you know? Wait. I know. It's a joke, chat. It's a joke. I'm not I'm not scared of a cold. I, I will say I turn into a wuss when I get sick, though. I get the man flu, you know? You know? And, like, I'm not about it. It happens. You know what? I'm just going to, like... If I just change this to a different field, then the trucks will leave me alone. And then I'll call him over when I need a truck. <laughs> when I have enough to fill a truck up, which is 180,000, then I'll change it back to the right field, and then a truck will appear. That's a five-head idea. Otherwise, they just leave me alone. They'll just be in my way. Well, that's good. That's good. Are we working on cows? We have a hundred cows. We do. If I get sick, then Zach goes on the setup because the show must go on. But then Zach will get sick. <laughs> We're not I trying to get... Do just what? send me the stream key. <laughs> I'll step in. I'll Lysol it first, okay? <laughs> I want to get you sick too, you know? Oh, man. No, I don't know. I, uh... It's a whole thing, guys. If the show stops due to, you know, a cold, the show stops due to a cold. It is what it is. It is what it is. Sir, can I get you to, uh, go away? Sir? Sir? Thank you. 
how do you get water? Uh, do these cows require water storms? No, they have oh. uh, magic. Water in them. I like magic. Yeah. Okay. They have uh, David Copperfield water. Or wait, David Blaine. Or Lance Burton. I think that was his name back in the day. Or the... What was the... the you guys remember that show... It was like the magic seekers revealed or whatever. The masked magician. Remember that? Yep. Yep. Golly, man. I used to be, I was hooked on that show back in the day. That was a good show. Good show. Barn has indoor plumbing. That's a new thing, you know? <laughs> yes. Uh, these do not have robot feeders, do they? Nope. No, you just take the food and dump it, right? Yep. And then magic ensues after that. Okay, why can't I dump this grass in the bunker? Uh, oh, um, I bet you I had this problem the other day, Storms. Hang on, I got you. I bet you this is it. Right at the very front, there's a little bit of scrap. See how there's just a little bit of scrap silage here? If you run the smoothing tool over it, it's it's like it's stuff that we can't clean up, like with a ah. loader or something like that. Try to dump now. I bet you, I bet it works. I noticed this the other day. I'm like, why is this not working? And then I did that, and boom. Did that do it? Um, back in the oh, you're going for this bunker. one. Okay, I was like, wait, wait a minute. Start at one end, work my way over. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That should yep, have. There it goes. Okay. All right. All right. So, yeah, I, I noticed that the other day. I'm like, this the only thing. Why is this not working? Uh, what? Probably go ahead and just glitch all the trucks over to stop here and I just dump them myself into the brain thing. Oh, I didn't think about that. That's a good idea, yeah. I'll try to keep an eye out and grab them before they okay. dump. I will say it's not like the other day where we had, like, the constant rodeo trucks because, well, we're only doing one mowing and our width's not very wide, you know? Yeah. Wondering where you couldn't or with the water because you couldn't find it. Okay, I got you. Yeah, they just don't have it. We just don't have that. We got plumbing here. Yeah, it's kind of a slow, like controlled, like don't really need four trucks. Like one truck would probably be enough to keep up with two of us, really. So yeah, but it's all good. But this will allow you time to get that grass moved and with that trailer you have it shouldn't take that long. Uh, the slowest part is the loading. I say those silos are pretty slow. Mother bin, hello? <laughs> you actually need this trailer sitting there filling up. And then you just drive there, hit the button, and away you go, right? Yeah. Use it like a mother bin. Always buy another one. We do have the funds. It's true. We do have the funds available. So we got to add that compactor in, did you? No, I did not. We, uh, we're going to have a lot more funds available later today, chat. We've got, uh, over 2 million liters of soybeans to sell this afternoon. So that should be fun. Mr. Plugger, good afternoon. How's it going, sir? Welcome in. What's up, Plugger? So yeah, 2 million... 2 million soybeans, I think it is, isn't it? 2.1? 1.1, I think. Yeah, 2.1 <laughs> and some change, so... That should make us, um... A fair bit of money, I would think. About 3 mil. Yeah. So that silage was 12 mil, plus another 1.3 on the... Uh, bonus is what that was the other day, so... That's pretty good. That's pretty good, I think. Right, this guy needs to stop bullying me, please. Change nice. change your field thing to a different field so they just leave you alone until you need them. 
know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's what I did anyway. So with us having trailers, we don't we don't need them for a while. Actually, we don't need them at all. We could just drive up there and empty into the bunker when we got full. But you know, efficiency. So we should be on a 45 right now. Which, by the way, chat, we will not hear from Mr. Efficiency today, okay? Oh, my God. Storms, there's another one for you right there. Mr. Efficiency. Yep. And then it's just a picture of Tony. <laughs> oh, I have the perfect picture, too. Have you ever seen the one of him with the beer helmet on? I might have, but... James, what's going on? How you doing today? I got, nope. I, I got it, right? <laughs> Gotta do it on a 45. Gotta do it on... <laughs> uh, you know, dash mystery efficiency. Here, this... I just sent you a Discord stars. <laughs> All you could... You just have to replace the text on his hat with mystery efficiency. <laughs> Right? <laughs> yep, I, I'm getting ideas. <laughs> that would be so good. Awesome, awesome, James. Keegan, what's going on? How you doing today? Uh huh, chat. Bad ideas only here at Puma Plow, okay? Bad ideas only. Oh, man. Man, oh, man. Peter, I agree. There's a lot to do in Farm Sim. It's really fun. I enjoy it. Why play it so much? Uh, Keegan, I'm here. We're doing. Uh, yeah. Just counting down the, the minutes till I get that cold that Dad has. That's kind of where I'm at. <laughs> oh. No additions. To the, yeah, no. We can't add anything to the list unless I, like, Call him up. He's uh, is that truck in your way left? It will be. I think it's full, but I'm not positive. I, I've told him to leave, so we'll see if he listens there in the next couple of minutes. There he goes. Uh, we can we can always like send Zach a carrier pigeon or something, you know, a uh, email to put something on the list. I don't know, something we can we can figure it out. We can figure it out. I think he's at a lake right now fishing. I think. Have I played any of the other Farms and Franchise? Uh, I've played everything. Well, okay. Not everything. I don't play the mobile slash Nintendo Switch versions of the game. I have played one of them, I think. Uh, I can't remember which one. I played like 20 minutes. I haven't even harvested one field. Let's put it that way. But every PC slash console uh, farm sim since, uh, what, 11? Well, I started with 11, then 13 is when I really got into it because it was on Xbox. I didn't have the best PC to, at the time to play 11. I mean, I'd, it was a crummy laptop and it crashed every like three minutes. Uh, so, yeah, 11, 13, 15, 17, 19. 22 and I've probably got like over 20 no definitely over 20,000 hours like total if you total it all up oh yeah well over 20,000 probably so I've played a little bit of farm sim just a smidge you know <laughs> uh farm sim 19 I had over 5,000 hours right around 5,000 hours on uh steam alone I did play 19 on console as well. Have not played 22 on console and don't plan on it. I, well, I say I don't plan on it. I would think it would be fun to fire up and like go achievement hunting. Uh, cause I do enjoy achievement hunting this game. Uh, but at the same time, I kind of don't see myself doing that. So yeah, we'll see. I did achievement hunt it on steam and that was fun. 
How do I not get tired of it? Because there's endless maps and there's so many different ways to play a map. I mean, I don't, you don't see many people doing what I'm doing right now, do you? <laughs> like, there's just so many different things to do in this game. I mean, yeah, and you go play different maps and, and I don't know, I don't get tired of it. And don't get me wrong, like, you know, Sundays and like, there's days of the week I just don't play it. You know, I'm not on here every day. And I do play other stuff besides Farm Sim. Not a lot, but I do. So, I don't know. I don't get tired of it. The mobile starting at 20 are pretty good. I gotcha. I, I think I played like 18, I want to say, on my phone. You know, my, my game's on my phone. So, yeah. Actually, Starms, if you want to steal trucks, feel free. You could have them load and just, like, park for you. Because we don't need four trucks to keep up with us. But it's up to you, whatever you want to do. I don't know if that's faster, if just, like, you fill in your big trailer. I don't know which way is more efficient. Efficiency. I can just like see the rainbow, right? From SpongeBob. Just saying. Most money we've ever had in Farm Sim 22. I couldn't tell you. I think we've seen like where 50. Right? Uh, where we have on No Man's. Oh, well, that's kind of cheating. <laughs> Was it though? We still had to harvest the ground. We had like 300 million, didn't we? Or 500 million? Yeah, it was north of 500. It's stupid amounts of money, yeah. You do a lot of production. See, sometimes we'll do a lot of production. Sometimes we won't do any productions. Uh, right now, we don't... Well, we do have some kind of productions going, but not like normal stuff. We have like... Technically, that bin right there is a production. It's making TMR for us. Kind of a production, but kind of not. We don't have any palletized like production goods going, so we definitely don't have any of that. That's all right. But yeah, there's just so many different ways to play and so many different maps. You know, this over the summer I achievement hunted, and like I went back and played like OG M Creek and like achievement hunted, got all my achievements. It was cool. It was fun. It was fun. Leave your headache, buddy. Oh, man. Gotcha, Wes. Gotcha. It is funny watching... Uh, it's funny, but it's not. But, like, man, watching people that went to TwitchCon, like, everybody got sick. Which, not a surprise when you go hang out with that many people, you know? Like, every kind of big convention like that, it always happens, you know? Somebody, somebody always goes that's sick, and... Gets everybody else sick, you know? You do a burner crap to keep the land good. Interesting. Alright. I'm at 70,000 roughly, so we're going to go ahead and get ourselves a truck uh, in route. The trucks hold 180,000, so... We'll go ahead and get a truck in inbound, and then we'll uh, fill them up and send them on his way, and then turn it right back off so another truck doesn't come to us. Uh, of course, if we didn't have our trailers on, then, you know, we would need constant supply of trucks. But since we have our fancy dancy trailers on, we don't, we don't need it. It's pretty cool. I like it. The whole thing is, you know, it's more efficient, obviously, to harvest under 45. But actually, this, this area right here kind of would be efficient out of 45. Anyway, um... Obviously, if the harvester never stops, you know. And if we don't have to stop, well, then that's good. That is very, very good. All right. Do you have trucks running grass for your storms or no? Yeah, I just swapped them to the bunker offload point. Okay. I noticed this truck over here, and I'm like, what is he doing there? But I guess he went down, turned around, it's coming up to you. Oh, running for me? Yeah. No. Oh. I still have running to you guys. Okay. I didn't 
didn't know if you just had them like fill in and run into the bunker. Belly dump trailers. Uh, for grain, yes. For like grass, not so much. But grain, yes. I would agree. A good old Wilson hopper bottom. Can't beat it. Can't beat it. I remember the days when everybody had straight trucks still, like a like a dump truck style grain truck, you know, with like a wooden box on the back or you know the fancy farmers had a metal box you know Ooh, you fancy huh <laughs> boy you got the aluminium <laughs> grandpa's old grain truck uh started its life as a tanker truck and he bought it somewhere and took it to a local welding shop and they had they took the tank off and then they uh lengthened the frame and then they built a I guess it was a hybrid, like metal and wood uh, box on the back for hauling grain. That was Grandpa's Grandpa's big truck. It wasn't big. It was a single axle. It wasn't much of a truck. But, you know, for Grandpa's 180 acres, it got the job done, you know? I'm just saying. Got the job done. Alright, we're going to let him uh, come up to us. I know we're stopping. We don't technically have to, but It'll work better if we do for a second. Come on, buddy. Come on. Oh, yeah. You might be surprised. Okay. Come on. Back in the day, there was these farmers. They farm uh, across the road from us down in the country from our place not i don't farm but they they were some of the first ones in the area that had semi trucks and they had these two old cab over i want to i want to say they were internationals and dude they had the best jake brakes on them all right that was so cool and i just remember them like tearing down the road and like oh you know stopping and just Diving into a field, it was awesome. They were the coolest old trucks, man. They were the coolest. <laughs> hey, uh, Black Cat's here. I was going to say Left Steer. Black Cat's here. Left Steer, too. Hey, Black Cat, thanks for the bits. How's it going? Right. We're knocking this out between the two of us. Getting this done now. Left's got a racetrack going on over there. Well, I'm getting tired of the tight circles, so yeah, I'm just yeah, I'm I'm not going back and forth. I'm running skippers. As Even well. the skippers seem like it was not enough. Oh, I'm skipping a couple. We should probably be running skippers together. Probably should for yeah. efficiency, but not forty-five. It. I mean, I can start a forty-five. Forty-five if... double skipper. Do it, you won't. No, don't do it. <laughs> what are the trailers? Uh, they're in the uh, in-game, or they're base game, the trailers, by the way. They're under auger wagons. They're there. It's a thing. Yeah, one skipper is almost not enough. Uh, but it's fine. Yep, go under. Well, okay, so we are using slightly modified ones, but... They're, they're, they're right here. It's a base game. That holds 50,000. Uh, Ours might hold um, uh, 250. And that's had the, uh, ours only cost 10 grand. Ours are really cheap. <laughs> we know a guy. Yeah, apparently. Uh, that see, fell off the back of the FedEx truck special. Oh man, you know, speaking of FedEx, they delivered a box to my house the other day, right? Yeah, run two combines, nice. And I was sitting out here in the garage when Buddy pulled up, right? And I don't have it on video, but like, just you know, it's the thing. 
Buddy absolutely yeeted that package at my front porch. <laughs> I, I heard him drop the box from the garage, and I'm pretty sure I had my headphones on, too. It was right before stream uh, Thursday. Buddy yeeted that box, and I was like, bro. Now, having said that, the box was actually in really, really, really good shape. So I wasn't, like, upset about it. But, yeah. Friend friend of mine on Facebook posted a video from her uh, doorbell cam mm -hmm. of the Amazon guy coming up with like a huge like bag. Okay. Just takes it, flips it upside down, just dumps <laughs> all of the packages on the floor. I think I've seen that. Oh, my OBS has lost connection to Twitch. Oh no. OBS, come back. <laughs> Why does it do this randomly? I don't. I don't know. I don't understand. Baby, come back. <laughs> you can blame it all on me. Okay, seriously. Okay, wait. We're back. Hello. 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 <laughs> Sorry, Chad. I don't know what happened. It lost connection. What are some names of fertilizer and cedar combos? What? Interesting. Uh, and no best, as far as the trucks are concerned, when I say single axle, it's like what's in the back. You know, you got a single, double, or triple axle, you know? That makes sense. Spring Trap Gamer, what's going on? Uh, at least that's the way I refer to them. Now, of course, I'm not a trucker or anything. I just, you know, play one on the internet. So, why is this truck following me right now? I have mine set to a different field. Uh, leave me just... alone. <laughs> I don't want you. Go away. Story in my life. <laughs> Wait, Story opposite life. story, bro. What are you talking about? <laughs> that truck's like a stage three uh, clinger right there, you know? Like stage four, actually. Stage four. Oh, God. Oh, God. Look out. <laughs> But anyway, so yeah, if I if I refer to like a single axle truck, it's however many axles are in the back. And then if it's like got multiple axles up front, that'd be like a twin steer or a tri steer. But yeah. Yeah. At least that's how I, I refer to them. I don't know. All right. There's rain trap. Gotcha. Cool. You just think it sounds funny. All right. And then a straight truck, too, compared to a semi. That's a different whole thing, too, you know? It just means it doesn't bend. That's all it means. It doesn't bend in the middle. So, like a... Uh, like a uh, propane delivery truck, you know? Yeah. It's a whole thing. Propane or propane accessory. Left, are you, are you all right over there with that truck? Or? Well, I don't really want to stop to fill it. Do you need him or no? Not fully yet. I'm still got some room. I mean, do you have 180 or no? No. It's like, cause yeah. if you have 180, you can pull him up and have him leave you alone. It's all good. At least the truck wants me. Nobody else does. So there's that. <laughs> Story of my life, bro. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what's poppin'? Welcome in. Um, four axle with a lift in front rears. I got you. That's cool. A big truck. There's a big truck out right there, Bobby. I tell you what. Wow. I'm gonna say um heavy haul. Well um, Alright. That's pretty pretty cool. Turn, let's go. Alright. Uh this is Westby, Wisconsin. Westby, Wisconsin. We're down here at the big uh, dairy operation. We're finishing up our uh, 
mowing process. We did a bunch of those uh, overnight with course play slash auto drive. And uh, we're just finishing it up because it was a little, little broken overnight. The little trucks got in the way of uh, course play for too long and might have stopped the harvester. So, yeah. It's the whole thing. So, yeah. Of the rolling hills. Yeah, this map has all the hills. This map's got more rolls than a, than a bakery. Okay. Just saying. Or something like that. More rolls than a bakery. All right, we're going to go ahead and get us a truck. We'll have 180000 for a for a truck here in a second. Go ahead and get it out of here and get it filled up and get it up to Storms. Storms is uh, taking care of the bunker for us right now. Putting all this grass. All this grass will be turned into uh, silage for now. Probably the next mowing we need to make hay again, right? No. No? Okay. Well, the next mowing we'll put in the bunkers too then. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. All right. And then I... Mida said the other day that, like, we should plant corn. We have wheat in our fields currently. And the goal was to plant wheat and then plant corn after. But, like, I might have said the other day that we should forage harvest all of that corn. Yeah. But I don't... You know, we actually... Well, I, yeah, I don't know. Right now we only have 100 cows, but we'll get more eventually. Hey, sells. So uh, if we're gonna, nah, we wouldn't sell hay. We'll sell silage over hay. Well, that's interesting, Nobel. Gotcha. Gotcha. But uh, the. The, the problem would be, like, where do you go with that much chaff slash silage, right? But I guess what we could do is we could forage harvest until all of our bunkers are full. And then fast time a day. Because corn harvest is multiple days, right? We could, we, you know, and you can start cutting a day early, too. Hmm. And then we clean, because ideally we're selling our silage in January, right? But if we started in, like, September, October, like, cut until we're full, pack it all, fast time of day, clean it all up, put it in storage, right? And then go back out with the forage harvesters and forage harvest till everything's full again. Could be a way to do it, I guess. I don't know. All right, where's that uh, truck? He's coming. Okay. Do we want to buy a piece of land today or no? I don't know. I don't know. So I was looking at 15. If you clean out all the trees, it's mainly just some trees that's in the way. You can pile that entire corner up as one map or one field. Dan, what's going on? I don't, I don't. I'm happy with the land we have personally. <laughs> it takes so long to do what we have now. Oh, I do need to go all the way to the end. Oh, no. I thought it was uh, enough, but I guess not. Alright, if we start lagging real bad, we know what to do this time, okay? We could have bales as an emergency stash, yeah. But we don't need an emergency stash. We've got, we've got, uh, that little, hang on, where's that? This guy here, this, this building here that's making us, um, yeah, I mean, there's a million and a half, 1.6 million, uh, TMR right there that we're not using. So, I mean, we are, but like, not currently, there's nowhere to go with it, you know, because the cows are all full. 
but it's all good. All right, truck. How come you got a truck and I didn't? I, I, I don't know. He's following me, and I don't know if I appreciate the <laughs> company at the moment. I'm going to fill up here in a minute. I don't I even have him for fifth. I... Oh, no. Where, where's the other truck set? Storms, you got all the other trucks up here? Yeah, I commandeered two. I've got the third one right here. That's... Send, send one back if you don't mind. Because for some reason the truck has a thing for left and I'm over here like full, so. I can bring them to you, you know, you can have them. <laughs> do you, you still want to set the 58 or do you want it to go? 58 is fine, yeah. It's he's fine. coming towards you now. Hooray! Nope, he stopped. <laughs> he's really got to think about life. Oh, man. Thanks for that follow, appreciate you. Welcome in. What's popping? And we'll just go down this line. Our lines should line up, right? I didn't shift. I mean, did, did you shift lines? No. Yeah. yeah, we're chilling. Hello, Mr. Truck. I could really use an empty. Thanks, bro. Over here. Oh, this is it. We're done. Okay, cool. We're down to the last little bit. Let's go. I might have to stop soon. 91% <laughs> hello. Secretly, he's still following you. I feel like he is. Like, I don't know why. <laughs> nah, he's, he's, he's chilling. He's chilling. Dude. Le yeah, left. What's wrong with your PC from last night? So, we you just don't. think it, it was just a bad driver interaction. We're pretty sure. Bad driver, huh? Like it just everything. Like power supply's been fine all day, and temp's been fine. And so basically, you unhooked things last night, right? I just basically unhooked it and plugged it back in, and it works. <laughs> but it would. Trent, what's up? What's going on? So if it doesn't work, unplug it and plug it back in, right? That's if if it does it again today, a power supply will be gone. Yeah, so we'll roll. I'll roll that out. Yeah, yeah. It might. Trailer doesn't see the truck. Truck's not full. I don't. Normally he would take off if he's full. So. Enough, yeah. Gotcha, Trant. Oh, 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 oh. We're gonna have one extra pass, huh? Darn. That was close to ending up on the right side of the field and everything. <laughs> it was sad and lonely in there, like in a movie. Yeah, did you guys blow up my house last night, or what happened? I kind of kind of dipped out tried tried did my house prevail yes did it really yep wow my cat made a bunch of uh, explosives okay and oh wow i don't even think he got through a wall wow i'm surprised it's still there mostly Wow. I mean, I would assume it'll just deteriorate because, like, there's no TC, right? Uh, I, mean, I don't know look. there isn't. Yeah. Oh, the, the MLRS rocket thing is kind of a joke in Rust, honestly. In my opinion, it doesn't do near what it should. The floor and the TC, oh. Other than, oh wow, that's crazy. Yeah, it'll it'll go away. That, that's okay. It's built different. It is built different. 
It's that stone, man. That stone is top notch, man. I get it. Got it? Yeah, I get it. I got a stalker here anyway. Or actually, I'll stop so the stalker stops or you can... You're, you're really? You're going to do that? <laughs> Come on. Just go empty into the bunker. <laughs> That's a long. That's a long drive. That shed's right there that we park in. <laughs> this guy, Chad. This guy. Oh, bad. Squatters might move in. Chuck, are you a squatter? <laughs> what the heck, man? Uh, Trent, can you? Trent, do you have Starbase on right now? That looks like they're. They're putting a, a thingy doofer on top of the, the booster right now. It looks like they're lifting this big old thing up, up right now. Kind of cool looking. It is near the train depot. That's that's true, Chuck. That's true. Yeah. Very true. Dude. I mean, the train tracks are like right across the street from it. It's strategic. Wow. Well, I mean, I know some of the electrical got messed up last night, but, you know, it's all the bones are there, right? <laughs> the truck won't pull up far enough for my well, trailer to see him. The walls are there. Yeah, as I said, the bones are there, right? Yeah. You just might need some, like, rugs or, you know, sleeping bags or something. You'll be fine. I mean, the server restarts th Thursday anyway, so it's fine. It's fine. Or you never know. Carson might show up and, like, admin just, like, get rid of my house. You never know. <laughs> Thanks for the follow. Appreciate you. Welcome in. What's poppin'? What's poppin'? Took some bandages. You got all those metal frags last night too, didn't you, Check. Took a bunch of them. Which is fine. Alright. Full truck. Coming to you, Storms. Allegedly. We're going to make sure he actually does. Because sometimes the southern edge, they get a little goofy. Uh, thanks to the follows, y'all. Welcome in. What's popping? Fast Dad, how you doing? Welcome in. <laughs> wow. Can reinstall for maybe the last time. That's Trent. 1800 scrap. That's not bad, Chuck. Not bad at all. Um... Actually, there. I think it got demolished unless somebody took it. But I did have, um, I did have like probably four thousand, five thousand scraps sitting in that one chest, that small chest in my uh, TC room. There was several thousand scraps sitting in there last night before we started the festivities. So I don't know what happened to it. If somebody took it, cool. If not, oh well, whatever. It was all for metal frags anyway. Because I would run the uh, stone quarry to get stone from my house, which I know I, I know the large excavator is technically more efficient, but stone quarry is just, it, it's just, I don't know. Fun. I would run that. And then, uh, it's whatever. It's a whole thing, you know. Uh, where are you working at, Storms? I'm just finishing topping off the first one. Okay. I wasn't sure where, where you were at, but I see it now. That's the one thing with these bunkers. They're a little interesting to see sometimes, kind of. Although with no collision camera, you can just, like, dip below it. That, that helps out a lot. Get right down into the pile. Into the thick of it. So it's kind of nice. I think that first one might be pretty well topped up, though. Uh, 2.5 in it. 
Yeah. About what it holds, yep. Oh, you took a drone too? Nice truck. Uh, Dan, we're working on, I guess we're gonna take it a minute here and uh, this first bunker will actually be ready to compact here in a second. Uh, first bunker is ready to compact and the second one we're gonna be filling. So if you wanna start working on compacting, Dan, maybe in that first one, that'd be awful swell. And then Storms, do you want me to work on filling new trucks or what do you what do you want me to do? Yeah. Yeah. Sure. Those bunkers are not part of the game, no. They are available in the mod hub though. Um on PC anyway. They're they're just straight out of the mod hub. I like them personally. They also have a ramp if you wanted to uh, put say a ramp up to the side. There's a placeable ramp that comes with them as well Which is pretty cool right, so What do we have going on? Class or... I don't care whatever you want me to do. I'll take the class uh... Uh, The problem is where's the uh... I guess you're not using auto drive for this right now, are you? No, okay for your trucks. Is there just grass in the first bunker, or is it? Uh, that metal bunker. Or not bunker, but bin. Whatever. Yeah. The metal bin. Made it all the way back to there. Missed the bleed over effect. Yep, because there's no way the truck should have been dumping way back here. All right. Do, 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 do. But yeah, they're just they're in the in the mod hub, and like I said, they have a ramp that comes with them, which I think is really. Cool. Uh, we typically don't use the ramp, but if you wanted to, um, say, put a ramp here on the side, you could totally do that, just like right into your, in through the house if you want, you know, whatever you want to do. Which is pretty uh, pretty cool, actually, if you ask me. All right, so grass. We only have 400,000. Oh, wow. You you caught up quite a bit, didn't you, there, Storms? As yeah, far as... Especially yeah. once I got two of these stray trucks. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's awesome. You were really rocking it, then. All right, so that's good. So we won't be doing this too much longer. Just... Um, the slow part is these bins. These bins are right out of the mod hub as well, so they're not uh, they're not turned up, which is fine. It is all good. Oh, we are topping that first one off, huh? Like all the way up. I'm here. Well. Not yet. True. Very true. And here's the beautiful part. I got a full truckload for left already. <laughs> and no waiting. Just like that. Let's go. All right. All right. All right. Yeah, definitely shouldn't be grass in this bin, but you know. The bleed over is real. Because if the waypoints way up here, they're actually they were. I think if the first bin we get full, they would start dumping back. I think, but I'm not sure. We may have to like move that waypoint back as uh, needed as well, which is totally fine. Big deal. Dang it! What? Oh. Oopsie. Where's the Where's the thing? I'll grab that. I said okay. I'll go right now. You guys will still have stuff on. Plus, there's that other truck there. So. Oh, speaking of commodity shed, what is that stuff? Mine. Mine. 
be using that big trailer for something. That big trailer. Why is there lime in there? I lined the grass fields. Oh, did you it. guys ever? Did you guys cut the small field there? No, I don't cut the small field. <laughs> we can, but I didn't. Wait. I my main focus was the big one. I don't know if that's even technically a field, is it? Here, can we fertilize this? Yeah. Like, has that been plowed out and stuff? Yeah. Oh, okay, I didn't well, know that. it was already... Uh, I think it needs grass. to be plowed, right? It says it needs to be plowed. Yeah, that's what I thought, yeah. But no, I did not cut the small field. You can arrange it. I did not. Right, put that down... Back to this. Right. I got most of a tray. Yeah, you'll be full. Go. <laughs> Gotta love it. Gotta love it. So fast. Super, super fast. Yo, Cobra, what's going on, man? Cobra, I see uh, you're posting Discord that you're in St. Louis. Go to Gus's Pretzels. They're open today. They're not open tomorrow. I think they might close early today, but they should be open still. If you can, I know you're, like, working. But Gus's Pretzels. Look it up. They're fantastic pretzels. That's all I got to say about that. They're so good. They're so good, it should be legal. Or something like that. Something along those lines, you know? Alright, that is... Um, that is all of the grass. Ain't got no more grass. Ain't got no grass in it. So, 150,000 last truck. Not bad. Let's see if we can. So, what do we have? Like a bunker and a half? Yeah. Uh, That's not bad. 1.3. It'll be a little over 1.3 after you guys empty. Wow. Well, that'll be 3.8. That's not bad for one moment of that field. Not bad at all. Could do the old uh, cruise control trick. I wonder how well that unloads. Like cruise control on zero and just creep. Do the creep. I mean, it works. Definitely works. Okay. All right. Dude. Oh, God. Is there, uh, Sean, are you here? Is Sean here? I don't know if Sean's here. Probably not. Need to find Cobra the Gus's Pretzels website. I'm telling you they're worth it. Uh, let's see. Are we gonna mow that little field real fast then, or no? Want to do that? Or stay with the big arms. Neither way, we gotta pick it up, right? So, grab this real quick. Only take like five passes, right? God. Oh. 
Yo, Chuck, coming in clutch. Look at you, Chuck. Let's go. There's the website cover, Chuck. Thank you. Chuck coming in clutch. Appreciate it, Chuck. Plus, with this, we can mow all the meadow grass. We can mow anything. I can dance all day. That meadow grass isn't cutting, so never mind. Has this been fertilized and everything? Yeah. Has it? I take care of my grass fields. <laughs> you need a fertilizer going out in the big field, too. At some point. He takes care of his grass fields. I've heard it all now. Heard it all. Oh, man. Okay, right, so maybe a big M would be faster, right? Yeah, I'm getting the uh, other thrown out, though. That's fine. Let's do it. Let's get it done. It looks like our yield's better this time, too. I don't know why. I've noticed that. I noticed that, like, in the whole big field, too. For some reason, we have a, a better, like, darker green this time. So, doing something right. That's all I know. Probably because the lime, right? Yeah, between the lime and the fertilization. And the coconut. Is this big truck stuck down here? Or is that... I don't it know. should have been sent on to 35 waypoint. No, he's stuck in a tree. Well, of course he is. If you have time today, save it in Google Maps. Okay, well, I know they're closed on Sundays and Mondays. Uh, oh, bro, so. Yeah. Awesome. Tell them, tell them John sent you. They'll know who you're talking about. They won't. Don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> they definitely will not know who you're talking about. <laughs> uh. Yeah, John sent me. You, you asked for the discount. Tell him John sent you, and he said there's a discount. Yeah, uh-huh. <laughs> oh, man. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Yeah, the Kumo Plot discount, yeah. Let's go. <laughs> oh, man. That would be funny. That would be way funny. Can I just like be a fly on the wall when that happens? <laughs> that would be hilarious. Don't forget to mention he's a big time streamer. And tell him Luke Kong sent you. <laughs> How about that? I think I've had a conversation with the one lady down there about how people say I look like Luke Combs. And I'm pretty sure she's like, who's that? I think we were, yeah, I don't remember how we got on that topic, but pretty sure we did. They got some really nice people that work there, so. They are, uh, they're good. Good people. And the part that I like is it's a good, like, family-owned, you know, local St. Louis-like business, you know? A good time. It is a good time. And their pretzels are really good too. Just saying. Alright, turning oh, I can turn my steering back on on my trailer. That'll probably help a little bit, huh? Sometimes this trailer in reverse, it's just a little bit easier to lock out the steering and not worry about it yeah. which is a great little mod which should totally be base game as well you know like gps just lock out that steering and don't worry about it that semi turned around sent on its way that's 
All good. You hear an air horn going past. Oh, it's not you. Okay. Today you learned that I'm not Luke Combs. Nope, oh, the name is John. John Plow. Because that's totally my name. Yep. That's what we're going with anyway. And if you know different, shut up. No, you don't. <laughs> How about that? Just zip it. Oh, it is. Just zip it. All right. Uh, that's funny. Well, I don't know that we're going to fill our trailers off this little field, but we might. We might. Oh, and for that corn we was talking about earlier, chat, we do have these bunkers, too, that we can't get rid of, so. You know, between these bunkers, those bunkers, and then those other bunkers, technically we have our bunkers in our OG homestead still. I mean, we, we have, like, four different places we could put chaff to make silage if we decided to actually forage harvest, like, everything we own in corn. We could potentially actually do it all. It would take a lot of time and stuff, but that's okay. I got time. Unless I actually do get sick, then, you know, I won't have time. That's fine. I mean, I'll have plenty of time to play farms, so I just won't be streaming. Yes. Nobody wants to. Nobody wants that. Just throwing it out there. Nobody wants that. We want to go ahead and cover the first bunker. Yeah, if it's ready, yeah. Send it. Brothers. I'm, yeah, uh huh. You betcha. You betcha, chat. Or something like that. All right, clean up skippers, you betcha. Let's. And now I just want to go to Gus's, and just I just want to go get some pretzels now. Every time it comes up, I'm like, man, I just want to, I just. I, I had to ask my nephew if they're doing fundraisers again at his uh, school. They did a fundraiser for, you know, his one club he's involved in. And it was Gus's pretzels. And you just have Gus's pretzels in your freezer. Like, hello? They're expensive, but it's helping his club out, so it's okay, right? <laughs> like, you could drive to St. Louis, spend the money on gas, risk your life, you know, upgrade your bulletproof armor... You know, and still come out ahead if you just went down there and bought pretzels as opposed to buy them through the the fundraiser. But it's helping his club, so it's okay. Or something. Did I enjoy my coffee and salmon? Um, so I don't drink coffee and I don't eat salmon, so nope. Uh, first time has made one cup of coffee so far through his Keurig. So, good investment. I don't know what those things run, but um, good investment. You know, I don't know what he what he paid for it, but yeah. Uh, thanks for that follow. Appreciate you. Welcome in. What's poppin'? What is poppin'? How's it going? Oh, yeah, I thought that was funny. He made it, uh, I guess that was the morning of pumpkin day. He, uh, well, that's not good. He made, he made coffee. So I wasn't even home, so I didn't have to smell it. Because I was already gone uh, when he got up. Not an issue there, you know? But one of these days, I know he's going to make coffee and salmon, and it's just, uh, I might have to, like, move out. <laughs> Chad, anybody need a roommate? 
I need I need space for computers. But like other than that, I you know. You'll never know I'm there. Or something. Go move in with my buddy Casey. I could have like the whole basement for my studio if I wanted, probably, huh? <laughs> I'd have a huge area. Basically, half of his basement's finished. Like, you know, finished basement has like carpet. Good old, you know, 70s paneling for the walls, you know? But yeah. Pretty classy. Pretty darn classy. Not that bad. I don't know, man. Coffee and salmon? Pretty bad. Pretty bad idea. Alright. So, first bunker is compacted and covered, right? Yes. Good. Second one needs some compaction or no? Technically, yes, but... It's just going to go down as you add to well, it. So. yeah. True that, true that. Well, we'll be done with this in a minute. We're getting all these little little spots cleaned off of this first. Go to the back and forth here, and we'll get her done. And then we get a fast time for, for uh, harvesting all the wheat. That's going to be fun, right? Or something. I kind of wonder. It's going to be like. Yeah, we got to be talking several mil million, right? Uh, we. Judge, what's going on? How you doing? Maybe the smells cancel each other. I don't want to find out. I'm, yet. I'm not going to lie. I don't want to find out. Although, I'll take coffee smell over salmon any day. Any day coffee over salmon. If I had to, like, pick which one, I'd coffee all day. Salmon, like, oh. Really not a fan of that. Coffee is nowhere near as bad to me. Yo, Judge. Sorry to hear that. I found out last night that my pops has a bit like a nasty cold, so I'm just like waiting. I'm waiting. I can kind of feel it starting, you know? Oh. Okay, number two bunker is compacted. All right. All right. Yeah, we'll be done here in just a, a jiffy. Yeah. Well, that's good, Judge. That's good. That's good. See, I don't know if, like, I'm feel starting to feel sick or, like, it's the mental games of, like, I was in close proximity to Dad on Wednesday. Like, we, we live in the same house. We're, you know, whatever. But, like, we were in the truck. We were, like, riding around on the side-by-side -side Wednesday. Like, you know, like, ah, uh, dang it. Salmon pizza. You know when I say that there's been a, there's never been a pizza I didn't like. Oh, Belks just described it. Salmon pizza. That would be a pizza I would not enjoy. Yeah. I would not enjoy that. No, thank you. But hey, that means there's more for everybody else, right? Yo, John, what's going on, man? Welcome in. What's poppin'? How are you? Welcome, welcome. All right, well, we're about to be done. This is good. It wasn't that bad. Not six hours like the other field, you know. Seven hours, actually, if it was all course played. 
which really would turn into about nine or ten hours because of like waiting for trucks. But yeah, long time. You're great, just chill it, nice. I actually, you know, on Wednesday or Thursday, we did the whole like pick up multiple like giant windrows. Now that I know how to actually use more than one truck at a time with this, with a forge harvester, I kind of think I'd like to try that again. Like, I'm trying to find the most efficient way, right? 10 hours is not efficient. It's different, but it, there, there was no efficiency uh, to this in the other field, you know? Probably won't do what we did. Maybe we would again. I don't know. Probably not. Van is in the bunker. Wait. All right. Ah, uh, yeah. I don't know. Say, now look out there, Dan. <laughs> Get a cab full of uh, grass. <laughs> oh, man. Not that it matters, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, Chuck, I always like, I like these bunkers a lot, personally. I think they're pretty cool. There's no pizza. Oh, okay. Uh, the thing I like about it is you don't have to, like, struggle bust and climb a pile and, you know, you can just, you can just dump it and then drive away. And it's, it's so much cleaner. And it's not a struggle not to, like, climb up on the pile and all that stuff all the time with your trucks or trailers or however you're hauling it, you know. That is something I like about it. Oh, and I did download the mod. I don't have it on the server currently, but there's a mod in the mod hub that allows like this header here to pick up straw. So we're gonna have all this straw from this from this wheat. I'm still not sure what we're doing with it, but we're gonna have it. So we could we could uh, pick it up with, uh, like, Forge Harvester. So, yeah, we could. Don't have to, but we could. Or we just let it go. I mean, it's free money, so. Oh, we're 100% compacted. Okay, all right. You just get out of the way, then. Park this guy over here completely out of the way. All right, do we go for fast time? Fast time to sell straw is December. So if we were going to pick up straw, we should, like, store it. Yep. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> we don't have enough storage buildings. Yeah, we do. 